everyone so let's go over what we need all right so first and foremost you're going to need two containers of water okay one's going to be a model of our clean water and one's going to be a model eventually of our polluted water or water that has things that make it dirty and not livable okay how are we going to model the pollution in the water well you're going to need some dirt if you can find some and just some household items that were either in the trash or your recycling bin or you just used and don't need anymore um, empty wrappers, plastic cups, bottle caps, okay? Anything to help you model pollution, okay? So I'm just gonna show you a, basically a simulation as to what pollution really does to our water, right? Which is a natural resource that we need to keep clean, all right? And you're gonna see the drastic difference between clean water and polluted water. So first thing you're gonna do, if you have a shovel or anything, spoon works anything works you don't even need to use that you can just take out your container of dirt and just start to pour it into the water again this is representing pollution and showing how the water is drastically right getting dirty it already looks drastically different than our clean water right and let's continue with some more pollution right some trash okay maybe we'll put a bottle cap in there we'll put a plastic cup we maybe we'll put some corks in there all right so now we have a representation or a model of polluted dirtied water that again is not safe to live in not safe to swim in and definitely not safe to drink okay or use over and over again right so now with that we're going to see how long it takes and how much work it really takes to um get rid of this pollution right to basically sanitize or clear up this water so that it can be possibly as it was before and let's see if that's even possible okay so I'm gonna take back my other bucket here again we, you need to be outside to do this it is messy and you're gonna need a lot of containers um, just to see how we can unpollute this okay all right so let's start taking out the trash okay that's first step, all right? You may wanna use a spoon, you may wanna use this cooking device actually, just to filter out. And even as you try to filter out the dirt, you're gonna notice that even taking after taking out the dirt, it is still, the water is still tainted, it's still discolored. It is not looking anywhere near as it used to, right? No matter how much you take out. Okay? Now, notice it would take a really, really long time to get this water looking back how it used to, right? Another step you can even do, just to really take it a step further to try to filter out this water, which will still show you how damaged and polluted this water really is, is you can take a coffee filter, okay? and you can actually pour the water through the coffee filter and see, okay, um, if the water can go back to its original color. So let's see how we're gonna do that.